News Force Dylan Brown is following this, and Dylan, the back and forth was on full display during today's meeting. You betcha, Kevin. Well, they put a hold on executive sessions for now. Today, Superintendent Ryan Walter said he questions the AG's opinion, saying let lawmakers in. Several Republican lawmakers speaking out after the meeting. There's not been a single no vote in this board since February 2023. State senators and representatives speaking out after the State Board of Education agreed to hold off on executive session for now. I think the board wants more time. They want to look at it. This 24 hours after Attorney General Gittner Drummond's opinion saying let legislators in, it's the law. But counsel for OSDE pointing at a previous opinion from the 1970s from a former AG. You've got a legal opinion from the person who legally represents you that says, I do not think that these lawmakers legally should be in this room. What that opinion said was the legislature has no jurisdiction over local school boards. It said nothing about this board um, or any other state board for that matter. No lawmakers so far agreeing with him. Republican House Speaker Kyle Hilbert on Flashpoint this week reacting. For an agency director, any agency director, to tell state legislators that they can't come is just wrong. The statute is clear. The attorney general further affirmed that. And so I'm <clears> grateful, <throat> you know, that any questions about the clarity are, are now set aside because the attorney general's opinion has the full weight of law. The board questioning the opinion Thursday, claiming student safety would be at risk if lawmakers were allowed in. We do, as uh, Kendra said, take very seriously the reasons to be in executive session, which include things like protecting the identity of minors. We're still governed by HIPAA and FERPA, and none of that would change inside an executive session. Overall, the board wanting to wait, see what happens. Is this what they wanted with the laws that they passed to govern our activities? The board seemed to thumb its nose at statute and the attorney general's opinion. Attorney General Gittner Drummond, though, late Thursday, standing by his decision, saying the State Board of Education may not like the law, but its members must still follow it. Yeah, and the AG also said the law OSDE council is refer referencing to has nothing to do with the issue at hand. It's unknown when executive session could return.